Jerome's haircut for me was definitely 70s influenced, rock and roll. Uh, Mick Jagger moved on to Paul Weller. So I wanted to create something that had much more shape, much more attitude, uh, and really live up to th that history that I really sort of, at my time, I loved. I started to prep his hair with Sebastian Reset Shampoo and Preset Conditioner. Uh, this already gives me a little bit of texture and a little bit of grip but I wanted to have a cutting tool, so I cocktailed Potion 9 um, with Shaper ID. Obviously this is a beautiful cutting tool, it gives me grip, but it also gives me that little bit more condition for using the different uh, techniques, whether it's the blade or the scissor. Simple, simple haircut. Um, I took a horseshoe section uh, from just at the back of the crown, straight up to the recession. Uh, I then just isolated the two sides by taking a section from the back of the ear and just clipped it away. And simply I started just from the center back, pulling everything out to my chest and using the blade to cut from shorter to longer. Obviously this sort of takes away a lot of that density and that weight, but it maintains that beautiful length that we want to create. Working from both sides, from the center to the ear on each side. Then came to the sides, and I continue to pull directly out to the middle of my chest and work towards the head. Same technique with the blade, so I'm sort of tapping and skinning to go from shorter to longer. I then just drop the top, I take my guide from the shortest point of the crown and I start to pull directly up in the centre of the guide in the middle and I cut deep point cutting with the scissors from shorter to longer. Each section then from each side is pulled directly into the original section in the center. This will give us a little bit more weight throughout that side section and then through the perimeter right through we will still use the pinch and cut technique and the pen cutting technique just to create that accent through the haircut. I went in with deep channel cutting just to open up negative and positive spaces within his hair. The end result with Jerome's hair is almost like it's something he did himself. It's lived in, it's rock and roll, it's completely lifestyle of what and how he wears his hair. <laughs>